I don't have the words to adequately describe how horrendous this guitar is. Just look at that fucking face. Look at that sexy fucking boy. Look at that gorgeous boy. Sometimes you gotta take a shit, you know? Sometimes you just gotta let it loose. That right there looks like a shitty guitar to me. <laughs> I'll tell you what. <laughs> Sorry. It's as if Michelangelo swooped down from the heavens and crafted this beautiful piece of guitar that you see in front of you today. Or a very drunk German gynecologist said, I want to make a guitar that looks like a vagina. Gibson, will you help me? Yes, we love to help you, said Gibson. This guitar is so stupid that it kind of just becomes awesome. When you got them backyard picnics where you just want to show off your new set to the boys. Ain't no gun laws protecting you from this one, boy. Yeah, who wants a beer? Yeah. This fucks with my head in ways that it really shouldn't. I can see myself stumbling home at two in the morning after a long night of heavy Bud Light consumption, reaching for my guitar and thinking, wow, I'm never drinking again. I don't have words to describe the discomfort that this brings me. Come play with me, Jared. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. <laughs> <laughs> the purest form of art. Argy mateys ever gented on the high seas. Let me tell ye, there is a ship that only one can call forth with the magic music of this instrument. Are ye worthy of the brown beard mix shredder? It looks like something Groot would play. Groot. Groot, Groot. I don't know why, this just makes me think of Atari. I wanna go play video games now in my futuristic beanbag chair. I think in reality, the ugliest thing on this guitar is the floating bridge. Yeah, I said it. Ah yes, the new Gibsons. Limited edition run. The ugliest thing about these guitars, I think, is the price tag. I don't wanna shame what you're into though. I mean, I love Star Trek too. This looks like it's gonna run towards me and kill me while laughing maniacally. It also looks like something out of Conker's Bad Fur Day. I bet it tastes like a starburst. A juicy, glorious, pink starburst. Sometimes, in a world of how, we forget the real question to ask, why? Everyone that owns this guitar is named Chad, or Chaz, or Cheddar, or Blaze. Oh, it's so cute. It's like a flying foot bumblebee monstrosity. I'm not even sure what this is supposed to be. Get it? This is just creative. I mean, if you wanna jam and you need some wax, I mean, come on. What better combination can you go for? If it doesn't play good, at least you can still wax your surfboard. Ugh, just stop, stop. Why are you doing this? What is with this half and half design? It's like a fucking pointy piece of cheese. Is that what you want in your house? A pointy piece of cheese with six strings attached to it? No, shit's gross, stop. I think this speaks for itself. But does it Bigfoot? <laughs> The Wangster, hell yeah. Looks like a 1930s gay shotgun. Also doubles as a torture toy. <laughs> just slap Sally on down in there and just get that guitar there. Get to him. Not only is it hideous, but it's an ergonomic fail if you want to play sitting down. It's like a frog chicken. Looks like you butchered a chicken, rolled it flat, petrified it, then added strings to it. Yo, what the fuck? You can't do that to me. Is this some labyrinth bullshit? Is this some like pyramidical fucking labyrinth voodoo king, goblin king shit right here? Look at this shit. Don't give this to someone on acid. You're gonna freak them out. They're not gonna know where to put the guitar strap. They're just gonna stand there looking at it for 20 minutes. If you're jamming and also snacky, this is perfect. Just throw a hot pocket in there and you're good to go. The faster you shred, the hotter the pocket gets. If you do too much shred, it's lava. If you do not enough shred, it's ice cold in the middle. Gotta get the shred just right. This one confuses me. I can't tell if it's a normal size guitar or the size of a couch. Looks like something from Dr. Seuss though. I think the cat in the hat lost this. Excuse me, cat in the hat, I think you've lost your guitar. Can you please come and grab it for me? Thank you. I just don't get it. Why do you keep fucking up tellies? Tellies are beautiful, majestic, gorgeous creatures. 
And you start making them looking like fucking pieces of cheese. You start taking out the end, making them look like fucking water droplets. Where the fuck that's supposed to be? Laffy Taffy, what the fuck? Looks like some N64 Clay Fighter video game character has this guitar. Stop, stop! Tellies are beautiful. You're messing them up. <laughs> I'm coming for you, baby, here we go. I like that these fish just look like they want to die. They have this look in their eyes that are just like, please, please kill me. I've suffered enough. Ah, Nubes, please give me the power of shed. He's got a cute face. Look at that, look at that face. It's a cute little face. He's a cool little boy. Yes, you are a cool little boy. Ooh. Well, thank you for joining me on this journey of the ugliest guitars ever. If you want to see the part two to this video, click the link in the description below. And my second channel, me and my friend Austin go over even more ugly guitars. And subscribe to that channel if you enjoy it. We're trying to grow that channel. We do a lot of videos over there every day. Check it out if you like it, really do appreciate it. If you like my shirt, you can order it also in a link in the description below. It is uh, one of my personal designs alongside others that I have on the website as well. If you would like to support me, that would be awesome. And um, yeah, the shirts are always in stock and they ship very quickly. And I would appreciate uh, the support there if you would like uh, some merch from me. I'm also working on the song for the 18 string video, which should be out very soon. I'm hoping anyways, it's taking me a lot longer to write one than I thought it would. The guitar is just ridiculous to play. So that will be coming soon. Thank you so much for your patience. As always, I love you guys and I hope that you have a great day.